hey guys, this is Jocasta Lester. How are you? <laughs> you are a spiritual traveler. <laughs> you are on a journey to God's love, okay? You are on a journey to God's abode. You are on a journey to who you are to be by potential. God gave you talent and things to do, and you got to get to where you got to go. <laughs> so, when you hear in the spirit, should you hear in the spirit, you got two different voices that you hear. <laughs> you hear the loving voice based on your potential and you doing what you were supposed to do, being obedient and thus abiding in God's love. The second voice that you hear is, oh my gosh, you didn't do what you're supposed to do. This is what I feel about you if you are something you're not supposed to be. So that second voice is something that you hear if you exist as something that you're not supposed to be. That is the voice that says, I don't like you no more because you didn't do what you were supposed to do. <laughs> okay. They are, all, they are also outcomes. Okay. This is the love you get because I love you. Okay. I wanted you this way, <laughs> but now you're that way. You're either a wife or a whore. <laughs> you either here as yourself and what your potential said, bang, 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 shit, bang. <laughs> or you hear what battle launch you here. Stupid old, I can't stand you. I don't want you. <laughs> I can't stand no battle launch. <laughs> That's the way that it works. You hear a form of duality um, because those things are both so. That's the extent to which I will acknowledge the duality. Not that they need each other to exist, but they are both so. <laughs> and your, uh, um, your obedience casts out the dark aspects of those things. And you go into pure light and you dwell in pure love if you do what you're supposed to do <laughs> based on who you are and your talents. Now. You also hear the schemes of the day. When you hear something that is contrary to who God wants you to be, stated by God, these are your enemies. There is only one God. There is himself and then there is a contrary voice to God that you hear that sounds like he's getting into alliance with your enemies. <laughs> And there's scripture in Leviticus, go seek it out. It talks about walking with God or contrary to God. And if you're walking contrary to God, you are forward. And with the forward, he will show himself pure. Excuse me, with the forward, Lord have mercy, you see? <laughs> Let Note that. <laughs> with the forward, he'll show himself forward. There's also something in my body contending against me for my own dang mouth. I tell you what. but. One way or the other, with the forward, he'll show himself forward. With the pure, he'll show himself pure. With the righteous, he'll show himself righteous. God gives you what you give him. <laughs> if you give him obedience, obedience is better than sacrifice. You have obedience to sacrifice. He <laughs> is not going to sacrifice you. I'm telling you that. Um, Maybe I'm stepping out on a limb here. But he would rather have um, obedience is better than sacrifice. But also, um, it's another scripture that talks about he would have mercy um, instead of sacrifice. Like, I don't remember right now the verbiage, even though I can quote it a million times right now while I'm making this video. <laughs> Note it. <laughs> but, um, I have to look up a scripture and there's something that's acting adversely on my mind right now. It's making it difficult to do. And I'm telling you, it comes in a spiritual form and it is a real entity. I experience spiritually such that something jumps in and out. But let me refocus myself. <laughs> Noted. This is what the devil wants for me. The devil doesn't want me to be able and the devil wants me to be distracted. You got it. <laughs> So repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. 
And just know when you hear in the spirit, you hear in two voices. You hear if you were obedient and if you weren't. And the God voice is the one that, that lets you know some <laughs> where you are. And if you're walking contrary to him, God is not a man that he should lie, nor the son of man that he should repent. And I'm telling you, God is not lying. When you are disobedient, there are negative outcomes that could result. Okay. Um, gross disobedience and negligence on the parts of many can result in an atrocity so great. So that I'm telling you about all this stuff about my son, because we might be pre-happening or post-happening or while happening. Okay. So return to obedience to Christ and do well at your jobs. Do things correctly and have a blessed and marvelous day. Those opportunities to walk contrary to God, you walk in accordance or um, with God's word. When you do what he said, do in the scripture, they have a for the love of Beyonce gospel going in, going in the spirit. And I'm telling you, because of it, there are spirits that jump on people. <laughs> and I'm telling you, they're evil. They don't know that I'm trying to make this video in some cases. Then they come and they determine that they did something stupid and it resulted in something really bad. Okay. So have a blessed and marvelous day and repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand, you guys. Thank you for watching my video.